So good morning students, so come to today's class. So today I will start a new chapter which is uh, uh, chapter number unit number 19 which is metric measures, okay. So in this chapter actually you have to <coughs> learn about the relationship between the smaller units and bigger units. Suppose uh, you consider a unit of unit of weight. So the lowest is what milligram, then centigram, then decigram, then gram, then decagram, then hectogram, and then kilogram. Okay. So the lowest unit is milligram. When you multiply milligram by ten. Then you will get centigram. Again, when centigram you multiply it by 10, you will get decigram. Again, when you multiply it by 10, this when you uh, multiply decigram by 10, you will get gram. Okay, that means look at this one 10 into 10 into 10. That means when you multiply milligram, milligram, multiply milligram by 1000, you will get gram. Okay, because 10 milligram is equal to 1 centigram, again 10 centigram equal to 1 decigram, again 10 decigram equal to 1 gram. That means you have to multiply 10 3 times. That is why 10 into 10, 100, again 100 into 10 will be 1000. So that is why when milligram will be multiplied by 1000, then you will get gram. Similarly, when gram multiplied by 10, then you will get decagram. There is, a, there is a difference between this and this. This one is DZ, decigram. And this one is DAZ, decagram. Okay? Again, when you multiply decagram by 10, you will get hectogram. Again, when you multiply by 10, you will get kilogram. The bigger unit is kilogram. So that is why you get this gram 10, 10, 10. That means when you gram multiplied by 1000, then you will get kilogram. Okay? Clear? So that means whenever you measure the weight, measure the units of weight, okay. So the bigger one is what? Kilogram, okay. Next is what? Hectogram. Next is what? Decagram, okay. Next is what? Gram. Next is what? Decigram. Next is centigram and the lowest is gram. Uh, sorry, milligram. Okay, so milligram, centigram, decigram, gram, decagram, hectogram, and kilogram. Okay, similarly, in case of liters, suppose in case of you measure the capacity of a uh, bottle, cap capacity of a uh, any uh, capacity of any instrument. Okay, then uh, suppose this was the capacity, this was suppose you measure in liter, then the lowest is milliliter, centiliter. Deciliter, this one is become liter, decaliter, hectoliter, and kiloliter, like this. Okay, so uh, now how can you write this one in place value table? You have to learn in this class. Okay, so in, in your book, already is given that unit of length. Similarly, if unit of length you write. Uh, millimeter, centimeter, decimeter, meter, decameter, hectometer, kilometer like this. Okay. So now place value table. The important thing is this one. Place place value table. Okay. So look at uh, the page number one ninety seven. It is going to let us represent 3275.416. This one is meter in place value table. So, guess what happened means you have to at first draw a table. Okay, next you have to. This one is supposed one column, two, three, four, five, six, 
7 so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 so first one suppose this one is given me just first one you write suppose kilometer next one suppose you write hectometer suppose next one is decameter next one is what meter again this one is what decimeter dm dm is stands for decimeter and dam is stands for decameter okay and this one is suppose centimeter and this is for millimeter okay so it is given the 3275.416 meter okay so 3275.416 all of you know that 1000 meter actually what 1 kilometer that, that means it is actually 3 kilometer uh, 3 kilometer 200 hectometer like 70 decameter and 5 meter like this so you have to write this one in 3 this one is 2 Seven in the uh, <coughs> place of D, D a decameter. Then this one is five. Okay, and no need to write the decimal because already we write the DM, CM, and MM. So this one is four. This one is one. And this one is six. Clear? This one is very important. So <coughs> in the next exercise, we have to in eighteen uh, nineteen point one we have to convert the given things in. Please fill the tables, okay?